Today was a monumental day. What up, gamers? It's your boy King Thrash back at it once again with another video. And I just, I, I, I just finished watching another video. I just finished watching another video of the PlayStation 5 setting the course for this generation properly. <laughs> and it's quiet in a motherfucker. I mean, nigga, you can hear butterflies peeing, my nigga. You know, have you ever, have you ever heard a butterfly pee before? No? Well, then listen close right now. A female butterfly is peeing. See, if you was thinking of a blood butterfly dick at that moment, then you're not on the right level. Okay? I need butterfly punani urination status mode. That's how quiet it is. You can hear a bitch, a butterfly bitch, pissing right now. All right? This nigga Greenberg. <laughs> this nigga guts. <laughs> oh, you know what? Uh, uh, let's go. There has been a triumph today. Dead bodies everywhere. <laughs> it's quiet as fuck on Twitter. Nigga, that nigga, this nigga Aaron Greenberg, fat ass, this motherfucker over here. <laughs> Leaving, talking about, oh, this game and that game and that game and this game is going to be on the Xbox as well, just to let you know. Shut the fuck up, bitch. You know what I'm saying? Like, shut the fuck up. Sony didn't even claim them games y'all niggas showed in y'all first motherfucking showdown. Shut the fuck up. How come you didn't show those games? Shut the fuck up. You're ugly. How come you didn't show any games, my nigga? Like, you haven't, nigga, you haven't even shown any games. You haven't shown the Xbox Series X in action. And you want to talk about how good these games are going to look because of power? How come you didn't show something then? If you got games ready, then how come the fuck are you ain't showing them motherfuckers, man? You know what I'm saying? Like, what the fuck, nigga? You got all these fucking games and shit, bright and infinite and all that. Why did you show PC game? Shut the fuck up and sit back and relax and watch somebody actually do some shit. Stop trying to ride a motherfucking wave, you fucking garbage ass nigga. If your shit's so powerful, the Halo Infinite better run some shit, my nigga. If it doesn't, it's a rap. It's already a rap. I'm sorry. Look, I'm sorry. Look, Halo, Halo, Greenberg, Greenberg, come here. Get close. I got a sandwich, Aaron. I have a sandwich. No lettuce because we know you don't want no motherfucking vegetables with that stomach, my nigga. All mayo, meat, and bread with extra gluten, nigga. Here. Get close. Fuck, nigga. Take the Ori clothes off. The game out already. You, it, it's dirty, Aaron. Take it off. Listen, nigga. Listen. All right. It's a wrap. Halo ain't gonna save you. Okay? Halo isn't going to save you. Halo can be the best looking game that I've ever seen. And it won't save you. Because they are launching with Spider-Man. They are launching with motherfucking Ratchet and Clank, my nigga. That is it. That is... There is nothing you can do. I hope to God. I hope to God. That Halo Infinite is sexy. But I know it's not. Want to know why? Because you're dumbasses want to continue to support old hardware with new hardware there is a reason why pc games look garbage as fuck because they want to take care of all generations and therefore their games get held back to the motherfucking maximum supreme and you're gonna do the same thing with halo infinite my nigga i'm sorry i am sorry you did it wrong you're about to learn your motherfucking lessons 
Now, I predicted my Nostradamus game was on point. My Nostradamus game was on motherfucking maximum, nigga. Just yesterday, nigga, when we was on with motherfucking Rand, nigga, I was like, nigga, that shit gonna launch, nigga. Or, or we, we, I mean, we're gonna see. He asked me what we're gonna see. I said, we're gonna see Horizon. We're gonna see Spider-Man. Now, I think some niggas was like, nah. I'm like, nigga, we're gonna see Horizon. We're gonna see Spider-Man, nigga. And we seen Horizon. And we seen Spider-Man. I was wrong thinking that Horizon was going to launch with the PS5. I don't believe it's going to launch even in the same motherfucking two years. I think it's going to be a 2022 game if you ask Thrash, my nigga. But Spider-Man confirmed holiday launch. Ratchet and Clank confirmed holiday launch. I thought Horizon was going to be the tech demo, <clears throat> but it's not. And Spider-Man isn't the tech demo either. It's fucking Ratchet and Clank. Ratchet and Clank is the game that's fully utilizing that motherfucking SSD. Ratchet and Clank is this generation's knack. You understand what I'm saying? I mean, it's this generation's knack. It's this generation's kill zone. You know what I'm saying? Spider-Man gonna be Spider-Man. It's Miles Morales. And nigga, it's, it's a wrap, right? It's already a wrap. When they announced that, I said it's a wrap already. They starting with this? Damn, they starting with they dicks out and hard? God damn, what the fuck is happening right now? You know what I'm saying? It's over. It's a wrap. It's a fucking wrap. But... Ratchet and Clank, that's the motherfucking game that's really showing the true power of the PlayStation 5. Ratchet and Clank cannot be played anywhere because the gameplay itself is based on that SSD. You can see load screens in Ratchet and Clank, my nigga. You can see fucking load screens. And I'm going to have to do an analysis because I don't know if I'm seeing pop-up or not. I'm going to look hard for pop-up. I believe we'll still see pop-up in this motherfucking generation, but I'm not sure how much. But you can see the load screens in Ratchet and Clank, and in my analysis, I'll point that shit out and show you what I mean on that shit. Even even the nigga, um, the, the Insomniac nigga who was talking about Ratchet and Clank, even said that um, that it's that there's load screen. He just didn't say that shit in in English, you know what I'm saying? But he said that shit, and I see where. Right when I seen it, I said that's the load screen right there, and the load screen lasts for like one second. You know what I'm saying? One one and a half seconds to load up an entire world. Not just the map, the entire world. You know what I'm saying? That's insane. That is insane. It's impossible because it happens during the fucking game, my nigga. That's why it's so fucking crazy. And I'm not talking about the part... I mean, I'm talking about... If I, if you want to... You know, I'll talk about it later. I'll talk about it later. I don't want to make this video that motherfucking long and shit. My girl coming through. I, again, nigga, she need, a, she need a replay, nigga. If you know what that is, she need a replay. But still... <laughs> Still, damn, I'm all sexual, my nigga, today, my nigga. I'm thinking about all types of Poonanny, because that PlayStation 5 looked like a motherfucking Poonanny. If you don't tell me that motherfucker look like a set of white pussy lips, my nigga, you got the game fucked up. You need to look closer at a pussy, my nigga. I, I will line a picture of motherfucking PS5 and a nanny my right there, my nigga, and nigga... And, I, there's a, there is a resemblance, my nigga. There is a resemblance. I would put, nigga, I would put my CD slot in that motherfucker, nigga, any motherfucking day. Any motherfucking day. <laughs> and and you can tell that it's a, it's a once again, a female console, my nigga. I mean, like, its name should be a female name. It's elegant. It's smooth. And have you seen her babies? Have you seen her babies, my nigga? You know what I'm saying? Like, God, like, it's just... Ah, oh, it's just crazy, my nigga. But my Nostradamus game is on point. Don't ever test me again, my nigga. Don't ever doubt the thrash again, nigga. I told you what was going to happen. But it wasn't really Nostradamus, my nigga. It was more of uh, Nostradamus with a hint of motherfucking common sense. Because I watched what Nintendo did with, 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 with Zelda. And it having a 200% motherfucking attach rate and then i see i see microsoft trying to come with halo and launch with that so i knew sony had to bring some guns out to launch with the ps5 they had to you know what i'm saying and so they got they got ratchet and clank and spider-man launching and i don't know what else i'm gonna have to check what else but this those two within itself i mean maybe even gran turismo these niggas show gran turismo dog it's fucking Rap. You know how many different demographics? I think the only thing they truly didn't show was like a JRPG. You know what I'm saying? That's all they needed to show. If they would have shown a JRPG, it would have been a full circle up in this bitch. Straight up, my nigga. They showed the multiplayer. They showed the the, the story driven. They showed the, the third person action. They showed the, the nightmarish shit, the, the scary shit. And they showed a lot of shit. But they didn't show no JRPGs, dog. So hopefully they get some of that shit going. But still, 
This is a rap, making like, Microsoft can do nothing but talk. You seen that fucking video? These niggas put out a fucking video. Nigga, like, an hour before PlayStation. Like, get the fuck out of here. fucking dumbass video showing PC for this bitch. The fuck? Microsoft, man, them niggas don't got shit. They don't got shit. And they fans ain't got shit to say. They looking for things to say right now. Right now, it's quiet. Because these niggas are watching and, and and combing through that shit with a with a fine tooth comb and a magnifying glass made out of a coke bottle, my nigga. That's what these niggas is doing right now. They looking this shit. They looking deep into the motherfucking gameplay of all these games, my nigga, because they know these niggas know it's a rap. They know it's a motherfucking rap, my nigga. And they like fuck. We gotta find some way to damage control this shit, bro. I feel so bad. Look, I keep telling you niggas, it's not too late to not buy an Xbox Series X. You can always buy a PS5 and enjoy gaming the way you'd like to enjoy them, my nigga. Real shit. Plus they show the digital edition, my nigga. Like, I don't, I'm not a fan of that. I'm not a fan of that. Because, nigga, like, that shit gonna be expensive, dog. <laughs> that shit can is she gonna cost? Are they coming out with two skews, dog? They giving you an alternative skew from junk, my nigga. Like, it's a fucking rappy rap, my nigga. Like, that shit is gonna be expensive as a motherfucker, my nigga. And, I mean, I mean I'm gonna buy it, but it's, it's gonna be fucking expensive, dog. You be looking at $5.99 at this point, nigga, for the, for the regular. And $4.99 for the all digital. Or $4.99 for the regular. And three ninety nine for the all digital, my nigga. And I'm going for the, I'm going for the one with the disc in it to begin with. I just need to have everything. You know what I'm saying? I I, I gotta have a I gotta have a top one. Period. I'm just I'm just that type of nigga. I'm I'm a toppy nigga. That's my girl, nigga. She be like, she like, let me ride, no bitch. No, no, no. I'm on top. You got me fucked up, nigga. The fuck out of here, nigga. I fuck you. You don't fuck me. You got me fucked up, nigga. So I'm gonna have to get I'm gonna have to get the 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 the, the regular one, not the all digital. I can't do it. I can't do it. But goddamn, some fantastic games were shown. That space game, that shit look interesting as fuck. Look interesting as fuck. That sack boy, I'm good on that shit. Nigga, Sumo Digital made that shit too. I'm super good, my nigga. I don't want nothing, nothing from any kind of remnants of Crackdown. Get me fucked up, nigga. I'm not saying it's gonna be a bad game. I'm saying I'm not buying that shit, nigga. If you wanna buy that shit, congratulations. I'm good, nigga. I don't want that motherfucking shit. Um, that Assassin's game and shit with the nigga running around. They're killing people from Bethesda. Fuck Bethesda, but the game look interesting as fuck. In fact, Bethesda had like two or three games, my nigga. And, and that was one thing niggas was surprised about because they used to roll with Microsoft with their games. They got these niggas running two and three games on PlayStation. Should let you know a couple things about what's really going on in the gaming industry right now, my nigga. But Bethesda got those two motherfucking games cracking off right there, my nigga. Um, they got that, and I forgot the other one. But I know I remember seeing Bethesda's name. I forgot what it was. It's an indie up in there that looked like Hyper Light Drifter. I want that shit. It was more 3D-ish, but, you know, it looked good. I'm going to get that shit. They got that game that's being made for the PS5. I'm going to just get it just to see and utilize that SSD. I want to see that shit in action. I'll, I'll wait I'll wait till I see some more trailers, but I got my eye on that one. You know what I'm saying? I got my eye on that. Um, what else they show? Cause fuck 2K. What's next? Nigga, uh, that shit look ugly. Nigga, I don't give a fuck. When that nigga was screaming after he made that duck, I'm like, that's a fucking PS1 game. Fuck 2K. I don't give a fuck about 2K. Um, or Madden. Or any sports games right now. Nigga. Um, what else they have? Oh, that one cartoon one, my nigga, with the, with the white girl with the black balls. Nigga, anytime there's a white girl mixed in with some black balls, it's gonna be a fantastic time. I tell you that much. Best believe it, nigga. Best believe it. I'm on that. This shit look good though. Um, what else was it, uh? The one with the with the space bitch in the air. She keep dying and shit, nigga. And, uh, she crash, nigga. Attacked, die, wake up, shit. I, I, I I'm compelled by it. I'm not impressed by what I saw, but I'm interested in it. You know what I'm saying? I'm interested in it. Um, what else was it? What else? was it other than Miles and him? Shit, if I can't think of it, then it didn't stick to me too well. You know what I'm saying? I just finished watching a lot of these motherfuckers. That racing game was garbage. Um, oh, Gran Turismo was fantastic, but the, um, that little action racing game, like, like destruction derby looking, I'm good, nigga. I'm, I'm good. That's not my steelo. 
you can probably like it I, I'm good on that um what else was it dog there's some other shit my nigga but if I can't if I can't think about it right now it didn't stick to me my nigga and therefore it can suck a dick nigga but nigga those games nigga, especially Ratchet and Clank my nigga I'm not even a Ratchet and Clank fan but that gotta be a day one staple because it shows it, it's the tech demo and I always you always wanna get the tech demo my nigga because those usually there's nothing that's gonna be better than that the rest of the generation as far as the tech and showing off the tech like Killzone was a hard shit some hard shit to topple it's still look one of the best looking games if not the best looking games it's up there as one of the best looking games and it was a launch game you know what I'm saying for real so you know I'm, I'm, I'm waiting to see all that shit but uh I'm thoroughly excited now. I'm buying me a PlayStation Day 1. Yes, I said it. They got said I wasn't buying shit. Now I am buying that shit because I saw what the fuck they bring to the table. Microsoft, the ball is in your court, my nigga. The ball is in your court. Impress me. Because you got a whole lot of work to do. The time is over for all the talk. The time is over. The wait and all the wait that people been giving you all the time they've been giving you motherfuckers to actually put some shit out the time that they fucking giving you to fucking do some shit we gave Sony two years to put out some bomb shit niggas said it that we said it yesterday man fucking been saying that shit for motherfucking months me sick royal nigga all of us at the round table my nigga been saying this shit nigga all of us on, on, on PlayStation podcast been saying this shit we've been giving these niggas two years of the same talk my nigga they didn't announce shit else new, my nigga. nigga They've been talking about Ghost of Tsushima and The Last of Us for two fucking years, my nigga. They better had brought it, and them niggas brought it. Them niggas brought I was waiting to get on their ass, because I'm like, nigga, ain't no way you finna act like Xbox, my nigga. Now, Microsoft, you need to do the same shit. You've been have you had whole seven fucking years, Phil Spencer, being behind motherfucking Xbox. Seven whole motherfucking years, my nigga. You've delivered nothing. This console... It's solely on you. You can't, you can't use a bailout Don Matrick. You can't use a bailout Oh, we did a DRM bullshit. You can't use none of that shit. The ball is in your fucking court. You either gonna fucking come and pay up or shut the fuck up. And anybody who got something else to say about like fucking Xbox doing anything or Microsoft doing any motherfucking thing, my nigga, and they don't do shit this generation, then I don't know what the fuck you're doing, my nigga. It's a fucking wrap. It's over. It's over if you do nothing. I, I've already quit on giving you chances, but now it's like, nah, nigga. Niggas is gonna really start going hard on you, niggas, if you don't fucking deliver right now, my nigga. It's time for you to fucking deliver, period. Because if you don't, what if you don't? This is a whole nother generation that you lost already. Day one. Skate the rest game, nigga. Like, subscribe, don't like, don't subscribe. Like, subscribe, or don't like, don't subscribe, bitch. Skin Thrust Gaming, thanks for watching. Thank you for your super chats. And thank you, PlayStation, for keeping gaming the motherfucking gangster shit out there in the motherfucking planet. And thank you for shaping your PlayStation like a pussy. Now I can, like, picture myself entering it every time I put a game in. Skin Thrust Gaming, I'm gone.